Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm just doing a really quick tutorial and a product review of the Turtle Wax Headlight uh, Lens Restore. It's actually a speed one with the heel and seal technology. Increases clarity and brightness and visibility. So this is the before of the glass and that's supposedly the after. It comes with ceramic wipes. It's actually acrylic ceramic and things that come with it really quickly. Precision polishing pad is two-sided. You get your compound uh, lens polishing kit and the two wipes for each headlight to coat it after and it takes about 24 hours to cure. So I'm just going to show you a quick example. All of these things are what I need for the uh, polish itself. The uh, reason why I have the Turtle Wax uh, wash is just to clean the headlight really quickly. Uh, the isopropyl alcohol is to remove the compound after I've done polishing. And these are just the rags I'm going to use. And this is just uh, helping my dad out with his uh, Oh, old Lexus SUV here with the headlights that are uh, basically yellowing with the lens as you can see really quickly. Uh, you can't really see anymore the shine of or the reflection and the reflectors. Uh, if we move to the right headlight, I actually already did it really quickly. Um, you can still see the everything is smooth again. Now there is some condensation in there so you're not really going to see uh, uh, the big difference with that, but you can at least see the reflector headlight housing in there uh, and it's quite shiny again. Uh, again, really quickly, we're just going to clean the headlight. So I'm just, I just have some wet, uh, wet wipes here really quickly. Again, DIY, I'm not going to wash the whole car. Just very little here. So just a little spritz over there. I'm just going to clean the lens up if there's any dirt and residue so it can polish fairly decently. So that's good right there already. That's done. Now this spray bottle I just had a little bit uh, filled up with water. So I'm just going to spray it down like I said instead of washing the whole car or the lenses. This is also a pretty good method if you don't have a hose in your garage. So I'm just going to spray it down, pretty good here, and another wet wipe just to clean it up. Seems kind of clean there and shiny, but that's because it's wet. So that's there. Just another rag here just to clean it and dry it off. And so once you see it, it's not exactly going to be nice and clean again. I'll use a little bit of paper towel. So this one I can actually say it does work uh, fairly well. I use it on my mom's car, the Acura, and it actually cleaned it really well and I do have those results on my uh, website at Spray and Shine. So what we're gonna start off with, uh, the kit comes with one of these bottles, the headlight lens, it's re uh, repair and renew. It's actually really just a uh, compound like I said. We do have the two bottles. So I'm just gonna be using one of them for now and finishing it off. All we need to do, shake it up a little bit. Now you can touch it, it is pretty gritty and not smooth. Just using a microfiber towel here. Again, all I'll do, shake it up. You can uh, just dab it on. What I do is just, just like a polish itself. I'll use it. Uh, don't need to be cheap with it. Like I said, this is almost done. So I'm just finishing this off from the old lens, just having a bunch on. Now they want you to just rub it all on and off for about 30 seconds. No need to be super quick about it. I'm just gonna show you this side. So just like any polish, once it starts drying up, you can just add more. Now once my side is done, I'll move to a different side. Just keep moving. They say on the uh, box itself to do it for about 30 seconds. Just 
back and forth motion. They also say not to use too much force, but you use just moderate pressure. Believe me, but the, you're still working here. If you've got a machined dual action polisher, that probably is best, but Hey, we're making do with what we have. So I'd say that's close to 30 seconds. Now it says once you're done, just wipe it off. It's just drag here. But if you look, that is a huge difference already. I can see the reflector housing already compared to before. They do have that sanding, uh, sanding kit, but I'm not going to use it, like I said, because this is actually not too, too bad. I'd rather not take off too much of the plastic. That's the final uh, run through. Just gonna wipe it down, take a little of the polish first with the rag. Now they don't say to do this with this, the next step, but I'm actually going to use isopropyl alcohol, like I said, to clean off the lens, remove all the compound from it. As you may know, compound has a lot of oily residues. With all this. And that's just wiping it. Now I'm gonna use some paper towels here. Now this is just 70% isopropyl alcohol. There are 90% you can use whichever. Again, it's just just to remove the uh, oily film before we coat it. So I'll just show you, it's white there. It's probably gonna take a white, a little more of the yellow haze, which you'll also see on the paper towel. So a little bit of yellowing if you see it a little bit or the dirt but now that's clean just tap this into the fall so i use i would say probably um for one headlight about three-fourths of the polish here uh so it does one kit i say well you can almost do two parts so next it comes in here glove just one plastic glove and two like I said, ceramic acrylic wipes. Uh, it drives in, dries in about three to five minutes, depending on the humidity and everything. But after that, it takes about 24 hours to cure. So it just gives you some cautions there. This should coat, coat it and give you some UV protection after you kind of restored your headlights for about a year. So you just rip it open. It's going to be fairly moist already. And all you're going to do is slowly, I start from the corners go around it just trying to avoid the paint really quickly run it through once once that's done it's not like ceramic coating where you got to wait for it to flash and then wipe it off it's literally just literally like wiping the headlight with it and then waiting for it to dry so I run through it once kind of fold the towel back 
run through it again. One wipe. The lens. So that's done. Just gonna throw this. And I'll go ahead, uh, it's not going to be in the video, but I'm just going to go ahead and do it on the other lens. But that's basically going to be your finished product. Uh, wait for that, 3-5 to five minutes to dry, and then another 24 hours to cure. Uh, not going to the car wash or in the rain, so if you check your weather. Once that's done, you are good to go. So will you, uh, would I recommend this uh, Turtle Wax uh, Speed Headlight Lens Restore? I would say yes. Uh, this car headlight has been kind of yellowing for years and years and literally if you, you saw it, it took me about maybe 15 minutes to restore it to this shape. Okay, uh, again guys, if you haven't uh, subscribed to the channel or click the uh, bell button, do that so you can get notified of my latest posting videos and I do do giveaways on other videos as I mentioned. And again, thanks for subscribing and watching. Have a great night.